three, two, one. Energy, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Choose Adventure, California style. On the banks of the Sacramento River is a little hidden piece of history that I find absolutely fascinating. And I wanted to share a little bit of it with you guys today. And today, this is what we're talking about. This is the old spirit of Sacramento Stern Wheeler Riverboat. So this boat was built back in 1942 for the Army Corps of Engineers, originally as a snag boat. A snag boat is a boat that they use to clear waterways. So at one point there would have been a device on that boat that would have helped clear the path of debris in the water. They used the design of the old riverboat because it could go in extremely shallow water. It could get to places other boats couldn't. The old spirit of Sacramento is nearly 100 feet in length and three stories tall. The old pilot house way up there. There's the old pilot house. So in 1942, it was used by the or Army Corps of Engineers. However, in 1954, John Wayne bought it. That is correct. The John Wayne, the actor John Wayne. This boat was actually the main star in a John Wayne film uh, in 1955 called Blood Alley. Essentially, it was a movie about John Wayne being a boat captain. However, he was imprisoned in a Chinese prison. A uh, nearby town wanted to get the heck out of town. They knew that John Wayne was a boat captain, so they got him out of prison. I think he was there for two years, and they utilized his skills as a boat captain to get them 300 miles out of where they were to safety. And this was the boat in that film that they used. So after the movie, he did sell it in uh, 1955 to a Sacramento businessman. It then allegedly uh, was promoted as being the largest stern wheeler west of the Mississippi. Now I did a little bit of research and 1955 Disneyland opened and the Mark Twain was there on opening day. So 1955 I looked up the dimensions of the Mark Twain and the Mark Twain seems to be a little bigger than this boat. So I think the Mark Twain was bigger still within feet of each other. At that time, this riverboat took people on hundreds of cruises. And this boat's been everywhere from Oregon to Long Beach to Sacramento, back and forth, back and forth. It's been sold and bought a bunch of times. It was bought again in 1959. And then bought again in Sacramento in 1961. And then bought in LA in 1964 and turned into a party boat. There were bars, salons, romantic cruises. In 1966, there was the first ever in California riverboat race against the Princess. And this boat at that time was called the Mansion Bell. And this sucker right here won the race. In 1990, it was back in Sacramento making cruises. And they used to have murder mystery theatrical productions on this boat. In 1996, at approximately 3.30 a.m. in the morning, uh, this thing was fully engulfed in fire and ultimately destroyed. In 1997, it was bought. The person that bought it uh, put half a million dollars to restore the boat, but it never was completed. And I guess the story with that, why it was never completed, is because the guy that was dumping money into it to try to restore this kept saying that they were pirates or looters they kept coming on board and just destroying the things that he was already fixing. So we had to fix things, looters would come in, screw it up, he'd have to go back, fix it again, and it just got to be too much work for him. So at that point in time, the, the boat was then abandoned, and in a matter of time, because it was damaged so much, uh, it started to sink in the river. In 2012, the abandoned vessel program um, decided to get this thing out of the water because it was becoming a safety issue. The safety issue was that if this thing ever became dislodged or bits and pieces started to float down river, it could harm other vessels as well as other structures down the river. So 2012, the abandoned vessel program decided for that reason to get this thing out of the water and it was placed right here where it still stands. That's kind of cool. The Sacramento airport is really close by. 
I just think how cool it is about all the history that this thing has from 1942, from the Army Corps to John Wayne movies, to cruising up and down Oregon, Long Beach, LA, Sacramento, murder mystery, uh, theatrical productions. There's so much in this boat. There's so many memories. Just sitting here right by the Sacramento River, right in the middle of nowhere, kinda. All right, well that was the little mini adventure for today. Hopefully you guys liked uh, learning a little bit about the old spirit of Sacramento right here, right on the banks of the Sacramento River. If you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't already, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know when new content comes out. I'm gonna start making a little playlist out of these mini adventures. Now go have an adventure of your own.